When we talk about facial rejuvenation in general, there are really five R's or five categories of correction. There's relaxation, refilling, reducing, resurfacing, and repositioning. When we talk about relaxation, this is where our neurotoxins, classically Botox, are used. When we inject in these two areas, it defeats those muscles that pull the brows down, so we actually get some brow lift. When we're talking about refilling, of course, everybody knows about fillers. The elegance of fillers, to be able to inject non-invasively, to get a beautiful result immediately so patients can participate. The next R is reduction. One of the things that happens as we age is we lose fill in places, we gain volume in other places. Sometimes you just can't get rid of some of those areas, the jowls, but especially that part a little bit underneath the neck. And now with a new injectable called Kybella, we can reduce the fat underneath the neck. We have another non-invasive way to treat this with cool sculpting. And then of course there are surgical ways with suction and, and other kinds of surgical reductions to trim that jawline. The next R is all about resurfacing. And we resurface our skin to improve the texture and the tone and the color. We can do this with product. We do this with chemical peels. We can use lasers. We really equate results with how much energy you get into the skin. So if you need a lot of result, you're going to be imparting a lot of energy, and of course that takes more downtime. But the results of the new lasers are spectacular. And then lastly, the fifth R is repositioning. When we talk about repositioning, we can get subtle repositioning with our fillers, but the true repositioning is a surgical event.